Do I need to tell you? It's gone. It is? <laughs> Has it been going the whole damn time? <laughs> okay, here I go. All right. Secret Project came to me, not just out of the blue like some visions do. Secret Project grew on me, a little bit at a time. I heard for the first time in my life about a thing called a podcast, and I thought to myself, what the hell is that thing? And then, I don't know what it was, the name, podcast, I don't know, something made me curious, and I went out and I found a book on the subject of podcasting, and it said, if you want to know about podcasts, you have got to expose yourself to podcasts. You've got to go out there and you've got to have a voracious appetite and find all the podcasts you can find and listen to them. And be happy if you find a bad one. And be happy if you find a good one. Because if you find a bad one, you know exactly what you're not going to do on yours. And if you find a good one, you'll know what you want to aim for. So I did. I saw a lot of podcasts. And eventually, I said to myself, Self? I want to do a podcast. And then came the, the age-old question, oh really, what would you like to do with that podcast about? It's not, the podcast part is not age-old, but the question of what it is you want to do. What do you want to do with your life? Very important question. And I said, well, that requires me to think. I'll need to go back in my memory to my childhood where I remember knowing stuff like that. Back when I was a child, I knew what I wanted to do in my life, all the time. So I went back, and I thought, what is the thing I would love to do most in the world of podcasting? And then it hit me. I know what I loved back then. Treasure hunts. I love treasure hunts. I love the whole idea of treasure altogether. Because treasure is it's mysterious and intriguing, and what is it? And, 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 I, and I realized just recently, no one knows until you find it. So, if I could create a podcast that involved a treasure hunt, I would be mixing two things that I really want in this life. So I started what we now call the Secret Project. And in the end, the Secret Project is nothing more than a giant experiment. A giant experiment in the world of manifestation. The question is, can a handful of people in small, small town Columbia, South Carolina, create an international phenomenon? And if I had to come up with a hypothesis, it would be, yeah, I think we can. And that's what we're about to set out to do. Thanks for joining me today.